In this tutorial, I'm going to walk you through the different packages that you could purchase when you're trying to decide on a hosting plan. So first of all, I recommend that you use Bluehost as your web hosting company. So what you're going to need to do is you're going to need to type in asknickfloyd.com slash Bluehost, B-L-U-E, and then host, H-O-S-T, and hit enter. And if you type in that URL, it's going to take you to Bluehost dot com where you're going to be able to choose between the different hosting packages so you're going to want to start off by hitting the get started now button and it's going to take you to this page here where you get to choose from three different plans so you've got the basic plan the plus plan and the pro plan each of them starts at 395 695 and 1495 per month but they all have a lot of different features that kind of sets them apart so running through the basic plan first you can only have one website when you go with the basic plan for 395 per month and you get up to 50 gigabytes of storage space unmetered bandwidth standard performance and you can include one domain when you purchase this package it comes with one domain so you get to choose your first domain url for free after that you have to pay you know 14 or 15 dollars per year for any additional domains you purchase you can have up to five park domains 25 subdomains and up to five email accounts and they give you 100 megabytes of storage per email account so right away looking at the basic plan if you're thinking about just building one website and you're going to stay pretty small then this might be the plan for you if you're on a budget but personally i would recommend the plus plan which it happens to be their most popular plan of course because you know for an extra three dollars a month an extra 36 dollars a year it's not a whole lot of money an extra 36 bucks a year you can come up with that in order to spend the 695 you're going to get a lot more features you're going to get unlimited websites so if you decide after creating your first website you want to create a second website that's kind of a spin-off uh that's you're going to need you know for your first website then you're going to want this plan so that you can make another website because with the original plan you only got one website so if you plan on making multiple websites this is definitely the plan to go with you get unmetered web space so you're not limited to the 50 gigabytes you get unmetered bandwidth you get the standard performance which is the same this part the performance you i don't really know what that does i've never experienced anything any issues with this uh, the plus plan so I wouldn't even worry about this I think this is just an added feature in here as a marketing tactic to try to get you to go with the next highest up plan included domains you get to choose one domain as well when you sign up for this hosting you get unlimited park domains subdomains email accounts and unlimited email storage and they give you two hundred dollars in marketing dollars that you can spend in AdWords and uh, at WooCommerce as well as Bing AdWords so you get some money to spend there if you want to do some paid advertising to get traffic to your website so that's a pretty good bonus that they throw in there that kind of pays for the whole plan itself so that's the one I would recommend but they also have the pro plan here which is $14.95 so now it's getting a lot more expensive and you don't really get that many different features than the plus plan it's just that they claim that there's high performance here and they give you a bunch of bonuses down here as far as you know site backup one domain privacy a dedicated ip and ssl all this stuff that you don't really probably have any clue what it is or what to do with it so i wouldn't worry about it overall the plus plan is the one that i use with bluehost and that's the plan that i recommend you go with as well so when if you decided to go with the plus plan you would just hit select and it would take you to the sign up page and here's where you get to choose your domain that it, you get one domain free when you purchase your hosting so i could type in you know nick foy consulting.com and you could choose if you want dot com or dot co dot club dot us there's a bunch of different options there that you could choose from or if you already have a domain name you can type it in here and it'll hook it up to your account for you uh, when you set up your Bluehost. So that pretty much wraps up this tutorial. I just wanted to give you a quick run through of the three different hosting packages that Bluehost offers and which one I recommend, which is the plus plan. 
To access those plans, remember, go to asknickfoy.com slash bluehost. Type that in, it'll automatically take you to the website. And it is an affiliate link, meaning that if you use that link and it takes you to Bluehost and you make a purchase, Bluehost is just going to pay me a small referral commission. Uh, but I, like I said, I use the product anyways, and I highly recommend them. I'm not simply doing this for the commission. And if you decide to use that link, you are helping support me in getting that commission. It's at no extra cost to you. So I'd like to thank you in advance for helping me get paid by Bluehost. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Be sure to check out more of our website tutorial videos on our YouTube channel, Ask Nick Foy, and stop by our website, asknickfoy.com, to see our latest blog posts and articles we've written helping you build a profitable online business. Take care.